So we are going to where are we going to? Laurel to get my HSG test. And I am super nervous, but I feel better after taking what did I take? Test for your uh, no, 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 the pill that I just took. Oh, uh, you popped in a 10 milligram of Valium, yeah. So I took 10, mili 10 milligrams of Valium uh, to relax me and uh, feel better, maybe no pain, hopefully. And I took two ibuprofen, I didn't took three, so I just took two ibuprofen and I already feel loopy, but not that nervous like I was like I got off of work and I was so nervous that I felt like I was going to throw up that nervous that type of nervous um, before this test I did got my blood test on the second day of my period and I got a huge bruise right there that's where they took it out it is horrible. I got another one, um, like somewhere there. You can't really tell on camera, but I got six pinches, and two of them look really bad so this one is one of them and it actually looks really bad look babe yeah. that looks horrible and it is really painful because I work with gloves and every time I try to put the gloves on it's just hurt um, but today like I said I'm so nervous I just hope I don't feel that much pain I watch a lot of videos about it and freak me out I shouldn't have done that but again I like to expect the worst and maybe it's not that bad um, I do have the referral and yeah I just hope it doesn't hurt that much I heard some ladies and videos that they said that their husbands are not allowed to go in with them um, and then other ones that they said that they are allowed so I just hope that wherever I go um, Paul can go in because I'll be so nervous if you don't go in, bae. <laughs> He's driving me because then I'm gonna be all drugged out in a minute. Maybe about an hour it takes me, but I'm already feeling my eyes going down. And I was getting sleepy already. So, fine. Oh, by the way, so the test that I got done on the third day of my period is just to check my hormones to check testosterone progesterone or something like that thyroid and th levels and all that stuff so my doctor called me today and everything seems fine even my thyroids that i really thought that i had thyroid issues like hyperthyroid issues they said that you can't have kids if you have that uh, or you have problems having kids and I really thought because I saw all the signs and they said your hair is falling and my hair was falling and then it says depression, depression which I don't think I'm depressed sometimes I am just because I get really upset especially after my period and during my period anxiety, anxiety. oh and moodiness like you will snap like this and I totally have that so I really thought that I was going to have thyroid issues and I was like, this explains everything. Like, that's why I'm so moody. Oh, cold. Like that you always cold. I'm always cold. My feet are always freezing and I'm almost warming up my feet on my husband's belly or my husband's legs. But everything is fine. So I guess I don't have excuse to be a bitch sometimes. <laughs> So, I'll try to be better at it, so. Anyhow, 
I was like, for a minute, I'd be like, oh my god, I got thyroid problems, and that's why I'm so moody. Like, it checks out, you know, but I am not, and I am healthy uh, so far. So, we're going to see today, and hopefully, my tubes are not blocked. Uh, pray for me that it's not gonna hurt. Anyhow, I'll make another video after the exam. This is the room that they put me in. I guess that's where I'm gonna be at. This is a machine. I don't know what the fuck is that. And the stuff are covered there. the bathroom. I got my stuff there. I'm so nervous. I oh, please God, let it not hurt. They left me here by myself. I just got out of the office. It didn't take too long, right baby? Maybe it took like 30 minutes. Um, to get it done so Paul has to wait outside because they say there is radiation and he couldn't be inside but um, I have to say I have to say this because I saw many 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 videos before coming into this appointment and all of them oh my god people crying so much pain um, it just feels like your period cramps times um times 10 nothing like that you guys for me nothing like that i was actually so surprised but again i would totally recommend to do what i did which is um i took the volume of 10 milligrams um about an hour and 10 minutes before my appointment and I also took ibuprofen and I only took two of those of 200 so 400 milligrams of ibuprofen and I think that worked really well um, I thought I didn't feel it the reaction of the pills but I think definitely it helped me relax and it helped me no gone crazy you know stressed out uh, because yesterday I was crying about it and like today I almost cry about it and then I took the pill and I was totally fine. So I'm so happy it did not hurt at all. I think Pat's, Pat smears hurts more than this. Like literally she was like, my doctor also was so nice, so nice. And if you guys live in um, Germantown or around Maryland, you can go here because she is amazing. They gave me this um it's a cd basically it would um i can see the x-rays and stuff like that so but i'm so happy it did not hurt at all and yeah um after she did what it did put the dye in um i was expecting the worst because they say that that's the one that is really painful but it didn't and then after we were done um, she did tell me move to your right, move to your left, and all that stuff. It's just a lot that happened in so little time. I also, they took me two x-rays before doing the HSG and then after the HSG. So, I don't know what those x-rays look like because I haven't seen them. Maybe they're in the CD, which I'm so happy I got it. So, I don't have to wait for my doctor. Well, probably have to wait for my doctor to tell me that hopefully everything's okay because literally I saw the dye going through my fallopian tubes and you know it looks normal uh, like videos that I see on Facebook so I am so happy baby 
my husband's so happy too because I guess I was freaking out about it. So it didn't hurt at all. And that's why I'm making this video because so many people say that it hurts so much and I was freaking out and I was crying and I just hope that somebody out there feels better when they see this and not freak out like I did. So again, you have to take pills to make you feel better. I think that had a, that had to do um, a lot with feeling no pain whatsoever, nothing. So yeah. I'll probably do another video explaining it more and more detail because right now I'm still in the volume so yeah just want to do this video right after right baby right <laughs>